Hi guys, welcome back to Bacon and Bubbly. And today I have my very first friend that's ever been on the show, Kaylin. What's funny about Kaylin and I is that we're both from the South and we recently finally was able to meet up. Yes. So Kaylin is vegan, right? Yes, I'm vegan like six days out of the week. So she looks phenomenal. She <laughs> always has such a beautiful glow to her. So I've been kind of a little bit on a plant-based kick. So today she's gonna help me make a buffalo cauliflower bites. Okay, let's start off this girl's cooking day with some rosé. <laughs> oh, perfect. Hey, yeah, cheers to you. two Southern girls making our way here. Yes. So what's your favorite go-to vegan meal? Um, okay, so I never cook normally. <laughs> <laughs> I only hey, post after this. Yeah. <laughs> but no, I do make like vegan tacos, okay. vegan like bolognese. Okay. I love impossible meat. Maybe we could just like cut out, you know, like make it smaller. It was just so funny because we I know we've been Facebook friends we've for been like Facebook years and years, so years, years and years. I remember like you and all the pageants you won and me and my mom, we would always tune in and watch you, especially that when you won so Miss funny. North Carolina. Oh my god. Yeah, we, it's just crazy. I was fangirling when I first met oh you guys. <laughs> so what made you go vegan? I just noticed my body wasn't agreeing with meat anymore. Yeah. And then I heard about all the you know positive environmental reasons to go yeah. vegan. So I am pescatarian one to two days out of the week, but then mm -hmm. I'm vegan the rest yeah. of the week. Yeah. I just felt like it was better for the environment, better for my body. <laughs> so we're just gonna put one third cup of butter over the cauliflower. And this does really well because the butters was going to make the flour stick to it. And then we're going to add our buffalo sauce. Dean's gonna be so happy because I don't cook. <laughs> yeah. And I'm gonna know some new recipes. And then now we're just gonna add our flour. I made these for Christmas for my family, and I didn't tell them they were cauliflower because I knew my family would be like, ugh, we're really? not eating that, it's too healthy. And my family actually loved it. Really? Yeah, they did. If you trick people into being vegan or like a vegan meal, yeah. they're gonna love it. Yeah. It's the word it. vegan that scares people. <laughs> yeah. I have the oven set to 350. We're gonna leave these in for about 15, 20 minutes and then we're going to broil for three minutes and that's what gives it like its crispiness. So we're just gonna put this in the oven for about 20 minutes. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, this is my first time making this. <laughs> So I like to just use a blender because I just like throw everything in there. It's less of a mess. So I got um, some vegan mayo, non-dairy milk. We're gonna apple cider vinegar. So this is onion powder. This is garlic and then paprika. Okay, so we're just gonna blend this for a couple of seconds. It smells so good. Okay, we're just gonna add our dill and our parsley. Smell it. Does it smell good? Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It really? smells exactly oh. like ranch. Wait, let's get a chip. Let's try yeah. it. <laughs> mm. Okay, they've been cooking for about 20 minutes now. And we've broiled it. And so now we're just gonna let them cool. Here we go. We'll have to make sure to save some for dinner. Yes. Mm. We're gonna be nice today. <laughs> <laughs> cheers, cheers. That ranch is so good. And then now we're just gonna have a little bit of girl chat. Um, I asked some people some questions, but really I'm wanting to know these questions or <laughs> answers to these questions too. What's your fake, like what's your beauty tip? What I've learned now is less is more. Mm -hmm. Like you allow your skin to breathe. I think that's been like my biggest thing coming out of pageantry is so much makeup. It's so much makeup and it caused so many breakouts and I've been spending the past like three years really taking care of my skin and like mm -hmm. making sure I have a day and nighttime routine. What's your go-to healthy snack? That is something that's like you're so a busy. lot of time. Yeah. Because <laughs> when we were in the van, we were constantly going to gas stations and, and even like being oh, vegan, yeah. it's so hard to find How like healthy you do snacks. That? I cut out soda, which is like hard for a Southern girl. Yes, <laughs> yes. And I used to get like chips or Cheez-Its or something. So now I gravitate Cheez towards- Cheez-Its are like my weakness. But now I gravitate towards fruit or nuts or hummus and veggies mm -hmm. or apples and almond butter. Mm -hmm. Something that I know is going to give me energy. Yes. How has it been owning a home for the first time? I love it. You and Dean are such uh, a little happy couple. <laughs> Their house is absolutely beautiful, you guys. She has a YouTube and she you've done a tours and everything, right? Like yeah. you've shown everything. Like what's your favorite part? 
I love the downstairs. We have this coffee table that I'm mm -hmm. like beyond obsessed with. It. I hate yeah. color. Mm -hmm. I'm like so anti-color. I want everything to be like neutral and pristine. But I found this marble colored coffee table. Yeah. It has like blues and oranges and pinks and that's my favorite. Do you have any fun trips coming up? Any van trips? Yes, we are going to Utah tomorrow. I think tomorrow. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I keep you track. are on the go. I feel like you're always on a plane or something. Plane, always. van. Right. We are going to the Salt Flats somewhere we've always wanted to go. Uh -huh. It's like this beautiful place outside of Salt Lake City. Uh -huh. First impression of each other. Um, I think because I just have always known you, known of you for so many years. When I met you in person, it was like, oh, I felt like we were just like immediately friends. Yes. Especially like when you see someone on TV for so long and then you've been Facebook friends probably since you were like 16. Yeah. <laughs> like almost 10 years. Yeah, almost 10 years. And my first impression of you, you were like the kindest. I remember texting oh. Dean at our dinner. Yeah. And I was like, I have never met a nicer person. Aww. And I was like, she is truly, she doesn't have a mean bone in her body. Aww. And I remember he said, haha, why? And I was like, she just truly is so nice. <laughs> 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 well, thank you so much for coming today. This thank really you. meant a lot. And I can't wait to, for our girls trip next week. Yes. Going to Newport, y'all. Catch us there. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching today. I hope you're able to try this vegan dish like me and Kaylin made today. Go it's grab your- so good. Yes, go grab a friend <laughs> and make it. Make sure to follow Kaylin um, on Instagram and also her YouTube to go check out her house and her next van adventure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll see you guys next time. All right, <laughs> dinner for Dean tonight. <laughs> Hopefully he likes this. Just tell him it's chicken nuggets. Yeah, <laughs> I will.